here uh, trying to fix my lobster bow machine I have an issue that the, the the motors aren't working, aren't responding. When I turn it on, nothing moves. I, I've been with it for about three years. And this is the first big issue that I have because, big issue because they, it doesn't work at all. So battery is fully charged. I charged it last night. Today's Sunday and uh, you know, when I turn it on, only this on full light is blinking. But uh, when I, I mean, nothing else works. All the remotes are not responding. I check the battery is full. I check all the cables inside are plugged in. Might be a fuse, something that is born, but obviously I don't, I don't have the tools or any idea which one it might be. So I just email um lobster technical support today sunday so hopefully they answer tomorrow monday and they tell me what should i do because i'm in uh, illinois in the chicago area and the lobster company is in california so imagine to ship this machine all the way there and bring it back it's gonna be like 500 dollars or i don't know how much for shipment big big money because these, these things are big Loads are very heavy and uh, I wouldn't be able, I mean I don't want to pay $200 just in shipping plus I check on the website it says they charge $95 an hour just for technical support so I mean to fix it you know if it takes two hours that's $200 $180 plus the shipping forget about it so I'm gonna wait to see what they say tomorrow and and if not, I'm gonna find a local guy, you know, somebody that fixes uh, arcades or pinballs. I already found one. So I'm just gonna see if I can do it by myself. If it's, you know, like change a fuse or move something here. If they guide me, the lobster support, technical support. If not, I'm gonna go check this guy. I'm willing to pay 200, $300. Hopefully no more than that. But uh, honestly, these things are very, very sensitive. They're very expensive now. And uh, I bought it like three years ago. Now it's like $300 more in 2024. $3,000 more from what I pay, pay for it. And uh, they're very sensitive. So just be careful, people. Watch out. You know, these are heavy to carry. I'm a 45-year-old, medium-sized guy. I'm not skinny or weak. And they're still heavy for me. So for a female or an older guy, it's very, it's something to consider. You know, if you're gonna be picking it up, up and down from your trunk or from your back seat, it is, uh, it is not that easy. So I will keep you informed. I would like to thank uh, Joe from Customer Service and uh, Lobster. I talked to him a couple times, and he's been very helpful very patient and he's been giving me instructions on how to fix my machine i'm very close to fix it so be be expecting a second video after this on how i got it fixed for a hundred dollars i just bought the parts and i did it myself but joe from lobster was amazingly helpful